I, uh, just didn't suffer a whole new level of embarrassment. I didn't just record for 20 minutes without, uh, without realizing that I wasn't actually recording and had to load back 20 minutes. No, oh, that would be the most horrifically embarrassing thing. Something which I, uh, yeah, something which the world will never know occurred. Okay. So. Okay, I'm back. Okay. So, we were going to face something most terrible that we went through all this build-up to get to. Nope. Look at them running back and forth like kids. Zoom! Whee! Oh, hi guys. Hi y'all. Should I give them a chance? Okay, they've had their chance. Now death! I'm tired of naked gremlins kicking me in the face! Everywhere I go! There. I guess I gotta give them one more. One more pat on the bots. Now, ah, something really strange I wanna show. Yep, it's a hundred. Keep that number in mind. You'll see why in a minute. Well, a couple of minutes. Gigantic, satisfying blocks of ice for you. All they really wanted was some ice for their tea. Look at these big old dragons with shields. Hey, Corona, why don't we just load up one of these, take it back to your place? You can sit at the foot of your bed. Badass, right? I got Saki! Now, I'm like Suika. See? I even equip it. Okay, so that's got a bunch more attack power. Remember that 100. We have a cutscene, and then it'll come into play after the cutscene, and you'll you'll know why. Okay, for you two, antipode. Look at it, it's even a different color. Now it's a black blade. Spin, spin, spin. Marla and Luca just kick everything's butt. Ah, oh, there's a there's a portcullis in the way. Oh, it's vicious, but I managed to steal Casimir's sword. Well, give it to me. Give it to me now. Masamune. So what? Wait, I don't have time for this. We felt the magical presence of our imp soldiers a minute ago. Because Slash apparently actually cares about his imps, which kind of surprised me, but okay. At the entrance, they're in trouble at the entrance. Ozzy and Flea can take on Casimir, but we've got to save those imps. Let's get on with it. Yep, Ozzy, Ozzy and Flea. Uh, they can handle Casimir, uh huh. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure they can. Yep, they'll have no problems. We got to go chase down those imps. Protect them. Okay, remember what I said about that hundred? Now I have a more powerful sword. That's it. 110. I don't know what's up with this. I swear it's not like this in the original Chrono Trigger, but in this ROM, for some reason, in this ROM hack, for whatever reason, weapons and attack power just don't scale correctly. I assume it's something that they would have fixed if they had had the time to finish this uh, thing rather than getting C and D'd. I at least assume that. It seems, seems logical to me. That it's something they would have fixed. One of the reasons why this game has been so difficult for so long. Now that I've got all the good magic, though, it's not such a big deal. 
I ended up, uh, well, I mean, I've partially ended up grinding and over-leveling so that I ended up with more powerful magic than I should probably have because of the, uh... Oh, doggone it. Statue, you got in my way. For that, I won't put you at the foot of my bed. I'll put you in my bathroom. Ah, oh, crud. Eh, you two got this. Seriously though, Chrono's kinda underpowered, cause he's like a really awesome, powerful character, except that his magic, well, I mean his magic was okay, but it wasn't like, well, it wasn't like Marla's and Luca's and Magus's. Some of my favorite characters don't have quite, don't pack quite the punch that they should. Okay. Now then. Hey there, Slashy Ban. Casimir's gas countermeasures made short work of them. Seems the Viper clan tried to help, but their soldiers also perished. Let's go! Ozzy and Flea will have Casimir's head on a stick by now. Yeah, I mean, just look at him go! You know, I've beaten Ozzy repeatedly, generally in cartoony ways. <laughs> I even stole his pants once. Primitive little things! Zeal gaveth the mystics magic to the mystics, and now Zeal taketh. Oh, what was that? You again! As expected, they came for the Masamune. Now we'll strike. Come, Kazmir. I've got a splendid task for you and your mystics. Uh, wait, who are you? Prepare for a crash course with John Green. Hmm, yeah! Yep, Ozzy and Flea really cleaned up. Wait, where, where's Ozzy? Hmm. Oh, hey, look, there's his pants. Okay, well, you know, the rest of him is not really important. The pants were the only thing that mattered. Everyone's gone, but I have a feeling that Ozzy and Flea are alive, but Casimir's aura has totally disappeared, as has the presence of his army. Ugh, that's unsettling. But we found the Masamuna, so we're good, right? This sword, it's meaningless to me. Yay! Quick, let's pull out Frog. He can have two Masamunas. He can dual wield them. Or he could assemble them into a super sword. Swords, swords can do that, right? You can just, just put them together and make bigger swords out of them. A, a sword is actually just several knives fused, right? Let's get that baby back to the Dark Ages. I guess I'll look for the others. Just slash that window open. I like how we don't even pretend to care about Ozzy and Flea. Slash is all like, I'll go look for the others. And we're just like, oh, let's just go back. We got what we wanted. I mean, why not just jump out of a second story window? There's no reason not to. Okay. Er, oh, er, hold on. There you go. First of all, Dark Ages, twelve thousand BC. So this is as far as I got was to get to the Beast Forest, which is where we need to go now. Hmm. Let me see, it was... Where's the Beast Forest? Beast Forest! You're not the Beast Forest. What if I just stuck it out and, you know, like one of these, one of these icebergs out here? No one would notice, right? No one would care. Okay. Drat. 
Well, I could just tell you because I already tried. Frogger. Uh, Frog cannot equip a second Masamune. <laughs> he won't even let him equip the original, the old one. Should we be clearing? There should be a clearing west where we can place it. Do, 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 do. Let's just put it in that fish. This looks like a good location. To think. New people come and go, and time is resilient. But move this sword, and the entire world is altered. That should do it. Hook things back or no to normal in 1582. Oh, yeah, last time I did this? Crap. Actually, we did miss something cool. I went and tried Frog, and he couldn't equip it. And then I came here, and his Massa Muna and that one reacted, and it turned into Massa and Muna, and Massa and Muna, and they talked, and I just saw something here. Crap, I could have had that all along. Let me see. Where's that magic tab? I was just complaining about how you're underperforming, Chrono. Have this. And if I tried to explain it all, it would give me a headache because the sword is actually two people. And Anyway, either you know what I'm talking about or you don't. But yeah, it's a shame I didn't have frog this time. Okay, and now I'm back to where I was. And in half the time, because I knew exactly what to do. Uh, and they told me I was supposed to go here. That there's a meeting Marla needed to attend. So, somewhere... Okay, nope! This is the wrong continent. But if I head out... Yes, here we are. Okay. And we're all set. I, I do want to go back to Chronopolis and change characters, though, after this. There's other techniques and things that we can unlock and use. We're having an important meeting soon. I'd like to speak to my doc. Here she is! She's, she's right here, man. Alright, fine. Here you go. I'm glad you're here. News must have traveled fast. The envoys are waiting. They say they're ready. Shall we go? Very well. Marley, you and your friends are needed. Follow me. You got it. Um... Nadia, the envoys are waiting. Okay, well, I'm more specific. Tell me where to go. I. Fine. Well, then get out of my way. Out. Shoo shoo. Alright. Take your positions, everyone. There's a chicken man at the meeting. Does he represent the chicken people? They produce various valuable products for trade, like pillows. All right, I call this meeting to order. Now, what do you wish to say? The people of Medina and Poor have come to an agreement consorting, concerning the Kingdom of Guardia. We would like to offer the choice of granting both nations sovereignty or ending your monarchy. Oh, well, that sounds fair. Yeah, you don't even need to... <laughs> you serious king? Are you going to waste your time with this? I'm afraid we're quite serious, Chancellor. We would like Guardia to grant independence to its provinces, sooner rather than later. In fact, we want it done immediately. <laughs> One word, gentlemen. Why? You're familiar with our prior grievances. Guardia's guild system stifles invention, trade, and business. Look at what Chorus has done with its freedom. A guild system? Hmm. Those aren't so easily abolished. Even if you gain independence, it's really hard to get out of a guild system once it's established. <laughs> Guardia's monarchy limits popular government. You're a dictator. Well, that's what do you want? <laughs> it's a monarchy. <laughs> in this place, Guardia Castle. Why do you hide riches and peculiarities in here instead of sharing them with the world? Because he's a king. 
<laughs> I'm sick of being part of this system. You feel the same way? Of course! We would like an official apology for pillaging during the Mystic or screw you! A war is a war! And the Mystics, you guys were crazy trying to summon Lavos and doing human sacrifices. And then there was a lot of time travel that went on and I'm not even sure how that all played out in the end. Not even sure what the timeline looks like anymore, we've changed it so much. Or what, you'll start another one? Our analysts, our analysts feel that Medina and Poor could defeat Guardia with minimal casualties. I'm not so sure about that. Please, please, no person alive today has known war. Really? Oh, okay. Right, the timelines have been shuffled, shuffled around, okay. Because we had started that thing with the robot from the future, but I guess that wasn't quite a formally declared war yet. Anyway, but we know the outcome. Let us not engage in military one-upmanship. No, let's. Here's a demonstration. Magic? I don't get the science, but- Oh, shut up! You use magic, Luca! What is this? Another mechanical doll like last time? I'm fresh and flesh and blood, thank you very much. It's a recent innovation in King Guardia called Elements. They're small devices that grant humans powers like magic. Like in Chrono Cross. Gentlemen, let's take a break. There are refreshments here. We have straight up magic magic, you know. Real magic is superior to elves, of course. Hey, no discussion until we reconvene. Ugh, the mystics are one thing, but if poor can use magic too, then... Damn, they might really be on par with Guardia as a joint force. Those elements, it's like what Chrono and Glenn mentioned from the Reptide timeline. Way to get going again? No! Quiet down, we can listen in. That demonstration worked well. Yeah, our little laboratory is putting out a great product, isn't it? What do you want? Wait till we reconvene. Okay, I just wanted some apples and bread and maybe one of these chicken things here. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just a couple potatoes on a plate. Actually, I'm going to jump through time, raid that laboratory, and then come back. <laughs> All right, let's get down to business. If you think a trick is going to be enough to make me surrender all of Guardia, you have much to learn. <laughs> but enough of your unclever retorts. We're the only side that has time travelers. Also, my party could probably wipe out your entire kingdom <laughs> by themselves. Time travel has made us very powerful. Another trick. You have nothing to do with this, I swear. Hi there! You look like you're just fine. I don't know how, but they're in the castle. Nadia! Quit running off and doing all of the fighting. You're not leaving this room. No one is. I'm sworn to protect you. And says Nadia and the others are tough fighters. Now I'll just tell the king to chill out. What's this? Is it behind? No. Okay. Um. Hmm. We'll go this way. Nothing. Ah! Where are these guys coming from? Oops. Wrong button. There we go. What's going on? They're coming out of the chambers and towers! The spotters see a mass of people pouring over Zenon Bridge! We've got reports of underground and external infiltration! They're humans and mystics, some like I've never seen before. 
What a way to wreck the negotiation with an invasion from 400 years ago. Where's the humans? Oh, I teleporting inside our stronghold. Now that's cheating. Where is this? I don't remember seeing this place. All right then. All right. Take the others and defend the perimeter. We'll handle things in here. But who's gonna stop that massive force approaching? Oh, hey, Master Muna. What are you doing here? What do you say, Massa? Ready to rumble? They've given us a lot of fun times. Let's repay the favor. Seems you guys need some help. Here, you can use this sword while we're gone. See the gilt sword? We'll handle those lackeys outside. I'm feeling weird energy in one of the towers. You might want to check it out. Whoosh! The sword just gave me a sword. That was weird. But, uh... Yeah, I guess I should go get Frog. I guess I should heal. <laughs> well, I guess we're gonna be sticking with this party for a little longer. I should have expected things to go terribly wrong. Where exactly am I supposed to go? What is that? Oh, crap. No, it's no fair! When they die, they join the other team. Why don't you stay on my side? This is a cool track. Look, y'all got nothing on me. Because Luca can spin. Oh shit! Fire and ice heals you? Wait a second, did the lightning heal them too? Crap. I wasn't paying attention. Oh please don't make me have to use melee attacks to fight these. Okay, lightning hurts them. But they have way too many hit points. Alright, we've got haste and cure. Hmm. What about Delta Force? Start throwing around buffs. Let's see if I can just wipe them out. Oh my gosh. Please? Oh. Oh. I don't want to deal with this. I don't want to deal with this as a random encounter. As a boss fight, I'd be okay with it, but not as a random encounter. <sighs> Alright, first question. Specifically, what is healing? Ice hurts you. Fire hurts you. It's just Antipode and Delta Force that heal you. Why? Hmm. Combining elements. Perhaps it is unnatural. And these creatures are unnatural. Nope, that doesn't make any sense. Nope, I can't fathom why. I'm guessing that in the game, it counts as a different element. You probably have a specific element that's, uh, those texts fall under. Fine, let me use haste. More turns, please. I 
have any lapis left? And you also need a medis. I don't know, spend the whole round just, just, just using items. And Chrono, you gotta learn Lumiere. We need it. You gotta be done. Come on. Alright. At least I know how to fight those now. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Rat! Alright then. Oh man, this is a huge castle though. I don't know it. Alright, let's try up this one. Hi guys. Um, how do you lot feel about uh, Antipode and Delta Force and that sort of thing? I want to learn Omega Shatter Flare. The other Omegas related triple techs. Those are awesome. Hey! That, that's not nice. I liked it FF7, the final attack materia. It was so great linking it to Phoenix. Oh no, my party got decimated. They all just get back up because Phoenix reses them. Don't, please don't let me become a descendant. I guess I found the right place. Welcome to the party, Dalton? Dalton, what are you doing here? You're responsible for this? Not really. You mean poor High Command? You should know. I never break a promise. Your little Guardia Kingdom is dust. As it feel to have everything you've ever known reduced to smoldering ash. I'd say it feels pretty good. Oh, how noble I've become, helping oppressed peoples resist a cruel monarchy. But they said they have nothing to do with this. Of course not. This is all a secret Black Wind unit operation. My new Four Kingdom and I are merely one part of a destructive dream team. And now, let the heads roll. What do you think you are, a rock star? Look at that bizarre pose. So that's where the invaders are coming from. I'm gonna kill you! This'll teach you to mess with Guardia. Oh hey, we get to kill Dalton. Ah oh, dear, those things. Alright. What's the best way to approach this? First of all, we definitely need haste and protect. And let's see how they react to a little bit of lightning. This is a pretty good party, all things considered. Ooh, that's not so good. Good. Yay for protection, magic! 
God, how do you react to ice? Oh, get my egg to be cut in half again. Gotta find what works. Ay! Party wipe? Oh wow, fire! Fire worked. If I survive, I can work with that. Okay. Don't get wiped out again. Lapis. Okay. Uh, alright. We need to run some ethers. I guess Marla needs it the most. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. I'm just gonna give Marla a full tonic. Okay. She's a magnet for your big attacks, apparently. Fire worked. I don't know if your elements are changing around or if it just works. But, I'm gonna try a big triple tick. It's probably, probably not gonna work, but we'll, we'll give it a try. We're learning. Looks like it hurt them. But it healed them instead. Great. Opposite? Lightning is the opposite of all that? Wait, does that count as a dark tech then? Got any more lapises? I hope we have more lapises. Eesh. for lapises. Alright. I know that fire worked. I can only single target heal, however I can aura whirl. Another blast of fire should wipe them. Why everything else seems to heal them. <laughs> Chrono's still wearing the super armor. Alright, Luca, I'm so glad I have you with me. If I had Frog instead of you, I'd be in trouble. I have used up all of them now. Every last... Lapis. Alright! Now it's just me and you! Physical attack, and you do that. Oh, I wish I had a lapis right now. Delta Force. I 
hope this is the hardest hitting move I got. Alright, poor bedroom! All the fire, all the lightning, all the ice! That was an okay healing. Marla, you need to learn heal all. You really need to learn heal all. In fact, the sooner you learn it, the better. Dalton. Look, hmm. attack. I get my HP cut in half. Magical attack. It gets countered. All right, we're gonna hit you again, Dalton. Hits. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a mad wizard? At least one more! It's okay, I still have some resources. Rapidly dwindling, but still some. On you. Shouldn't hurt you that much. There, you can fix yourself. Alright, we're ready to pull it off again. Hopefully Luca won't go under. Darn! I took out your gin, buddies. Even the things that they resisted were hurting you. Come on, how many hits can you take? Is this a fight I'm not supposed to be able to win? seem highly variable. Ah, forking Spoonie. I was trying to get her to heal herself. Go for another attack. Go! Smash! Come on, this has to be it. Ah! Don't pretend like you're still alive. Just turn red and disappear, guy. Ooh. <laughs> heh. 
I just had to pause. You realize what's going on right now, don't you? I have no clue. Tell me. A sea of fire engulfing all of truce. Not Gato! Disengaging safety controls. <laughs> Like we have to go back in time and stop this from happening somehow, although they travel through time. I'm not entirely sure. That's what happens when you go and in invade a mad scientist's house. Pick the wrong house, buddy. <laughs> you can't beat the Massa Moon! Beautiful sight brings a tear to my eye. Die. <laughs> Let's clean up the rest. Come on. I'm so asking for a raise. What you th everything is burning, lady. Really done it this time. We won't soon forget it. I told you, poor has nothing to do with this. Enough. I swear if my daughter's hurt, I will kill you right here. Hi, what are you after? Stop right there or you're dead. That's how I fight too, when I want to intimidate somebody. I just clasp my hands behind my back. Got anything for me? No. Of course not. Can I get a save point, please? I would like a save point. It would make me feel better. Daddy, what do you see? Whoa, you have some kind of super royal magical power I don't know about? Hi, Nadia. You have to get away. Run for your life. Guess not. Stuff your weapons. You wouldn't have a chance anyway. What's going on? What are you doing to him? Administering justice, that's what. Did you ever stop to think about how many you've killed? For example, an entire lifetime of reptiles, billions of organisms and life forms. No, that's not true. Do you know where lost timelines end up? The darkness beyond time. Forever zero, eternally null. Entire possibilities subsumed into a temporal netherworld. That's where I'm sending your father, my dear. And soon I'll revive my kingdom as well. I'll be taking this. Say goodbye to your father. Nothing sent to that darkness can be revived. A fitting punishment. I'm sorry, Marla. Father! <laughs> hey, that's... <laughs> now that... That guy belongs to me. Heh, <laughs> another priceless artifact of zeal. The king is waiting. <laughs> Damn king to keep the king waiting, eh? Got here as soon as I could. I'm just shocked. The generals were given no warning of this. And if what you say is good, true, High Command is... Truce is in ruins and the castle has been gutted. Do you know how many ki people were killed or displaced because of Kor's... Kor's apparent actions? None of us ever imagined something like this. What's to stop angry guardians from storming Por? Por was a shill for Dalton, who takes orders from King Zeal. I hope his sick little fascination with us is satisfied. 
father's gone. Yes, Nadia, I'm sorry. On oh, chief, you vile filth. What do you propose to do about this? I will. As of now, by my authority, the kingdom of Guardia is now Guardia, an independent northern province of Poor. And by my authority, Poor fully recognizes your ancient custom. Marla is now queen and regent. Um, she's already the queen the moment the king died, regardless of what you say. My men are waiting outside. I have to coordinate aid and relief. Queen Marla, King Crote King? Wait, am I married to her? I missed that one! What should be done? Those titles. It's more than Dalton ever achieved, you know. Chancellor, I grant you action control according to Section 17 of the Lordly Laws. I'll be leaving now with my friends. But the people need you! They must know you're alive! Perhaps we'll survey the damage. I won't be away long, just long enough to avenge his death. Have those envoys proven their innocence? Things check out so far, but the elements will still perturb me. Who knows if their laboratories answer to generals like Montcrief or Dalton. We'll find out in good time. Yeah, I'd like to get to the bottom of these tricks. Marla, let's go home and rest. Things seem to be safe for now. Oh, wow. Oh. Did you sleep? Hardly. Yeah. It wasn't a dream. I guess not. He's really gone. Never wanted to be queen this way. Generally, that's how you become monarch, is the previous monarch dies in one way or another. Did you plan to become queen by him becoming immortal? You're still loved? No. Many people in this world hate me. They think Guardi is evil. But the right people love you, our friends, and... Thank you, Chrono. High five! <laughs> <laughs> A good two-handed high five fixes anybody's spirits when they're down. <laughs> I all survived too, and we found your cat, Chrono! Cats have a way of surviving these kinds of things. You okay, Marla? Yeah, but uh, how are Tabin and Laura? Fine, fine. They're looking after some displaced children. Gatto's even still kicking. We found him at Lean Square. Apparently he took out five monsters. Man, Gatto doesn't screw around. Just what I'd expect from the brilliant inventor Luca. Ah, of course! <laughs> Thanks for everything, Luca. I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're all right, too. That makes three of us. Guess we should survey the damage and head back to Chronopolis. Alright, ready, Marla? Yep. Boop! Pretty sure you three are a combo. I can let Marla lead for now. Chrono just turns into Magus. <laughs> Grew my hair out, learned to levitate. I just can't get used to this. I'll be busy for ages helping others. Let's take a peek. Five years ago we celebrated peace. Now look at this. Uh, that poor guy's mind. It has been broken. I don't get it. They could have taken Guardia through the castle alone. No reason to destroy truce. Poor High Command must have been particularly malicious to us Northerners. Head to Luca's place. Where he went off to. 
hide and seek time? <laughs> God, he enjoyed prosperity for a thousand years. It's poor turn. No, it's not. This would be a great spot for a poor Medina shrine, eh? Yeah, hey, who are those guys behind us? Truce people? Just act like they're not there. You'll remove that bell only over my dead body. So sorry. What are we supposed to do now? Oh, Marla, I'm so sorry. Oh, Aisha, how could you? Don't sneak up on people like that. I'm the queen. Shut up! I sneak up on whoever I want. Let's not pick a fight with that. Ah! That's what we needed. Cheery music! Did you hear the latest gossip? No, I haven't! They say Nadia granted 17 to the Chancellor. But she feels she can't rule on her own. You people are so daft. Look, there's even a statue of her right there, and you still fail to recognize your queen? I like Frog's pose, he's just hiding his face. <clears throat> Camera shy or sculptor shy? I don't need that. I got a proper time machine. Huh. It's all broke, did it? Most of the buildings are too wrecked, huh? Hey, yeah, did you know about our establishment? The mayor's educational. Uh, never mind. I don't need tutorial, bless. Let's see how you are know doing. That's right. If anybody else tries to invade, they'll trip over books. So devious. Your defenses are a work of art, Taven. Chancellor's asked me to build a monument for the fallen king. I try to start, but I get a little emotional every time. If you build a statue of him, it's probably going to have lasers <laughs> installed in it. Might be troublesome, but if you find them, can you bring them here? We'll try to find their parents. And that also ties into something about Chrono Cross. Oops, wait, what? Hold on, you had more to say. Marla, always be a princess. Oh, Luca, you heard about the lost. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, never mind. Find children, bring them here. Well, I found one, but he scurried away. I wonder what became of that kid. Should we hunt for lost children? Or should we jump through time to, uh, Chronopolis once more? It's really hard to fight other time travelers, you know? A court martial and poor isn't enough of an apology for this. Only men could do something like this. Actually, most of them were monsters, but whatever you say. Where did that kid go? There's not a lot of places he could have hidden. Mm. Oh well, I bet there's a child hiding at the church. Unless they've torched that, too. Yep, yep, the king's funeral. Oh, I don't see any children. Well, we might investigate all of this later. Alright, let's finish up for today by paying a visit to Chronopolis. Epoch, you are cleared for landing. Hey guys! Good, uh. Could you not help me fix this weird uh, thing that happened in my kingdom? No, because it's other time travelers. And they're immune to our time trickery, sort of. God. And they're 
still a reptile time traveler somewhere. Someone. What are your thoughts? You, you. Why didn't you tell us this would happen? Huh? We can't track King Zeal. I had no idea he'd a time guardian castle. And what's the point of all this? He's following us. If we hadn't gone to 1005 AD, Marla, it, it was gonna happen somehow, anyway. History showed that your father would soon die of a heart condition, and he would have conceded control in that meeting. King Zeal just made it all personal, nothing more. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of doing your errands. Listen, we've been making headway with King Zeal, but we're not quite ready. In the meantime, I'd like you to meet someone who's due to arrive any second now. Oh! Okay. Well, mission complete. Ah, you weren't kidding. A time fortress. And it's you. I thought you died with the rebels. What? Different timeline. Everyone. Without a vanguard or rebellions, Kakulha explored on his own. Yes, I honestly can't believe that this hu this was a human world all along. I have much to learn. What became of Yaluk and Koyopa, though? Yaluk's in prehistory, and I don't think she's interested in leading, leaving. As for Koyopa, he'd be in 1005 AD, correct? We didn't see him there. We believe he was captured by Poor, and they're, that they're researching his elements. It's all rather inconsequential, though. Medina destroys the laboratory in 1006 AD, and the elements are lost. Still, is there a chance to rescue him? Uh, I hadn't thought of that. He'd be at the poor lab. If the lab gets destroyed anyway, we could go there and destroy it ourselves with no consequences, right? Heh. <laughs> Fancying a little revenge for the fall of Guardia. Sorry. But if you're fancying it, I see nothing wrong with the idea. Sorry, but if you're fancying it, I see nothing wrong with the idea. So what's the sorry about? Kakulka's talked to Agent 12 and is going to join the Chronopolis team. The more the merrier. Well, it might feel nice to get back at core. Eh, whatever helps. Check out the forest ruins in 1580 then. We'll keep working on things here. Now, Kakoka, let's get you situated. Huh. I wasn't expecting that. Oh. A reptite from a time. Okay, well, let's meet him. We always thought that perhaps we were foreign to the planet. Unclanny to think that the planet chose you humans in the end. But if that's the planet's wish... You reptites are weird. See us humans? We don't think like that. We'd be like, SURVIVAL OF THE FITTEST! TIME TRAVEL! LET'S FIX THIS! <laughs> Whatever the original timeline did doesn't matter. <laughs> we will exist. Guess that's why humans came out over you reptites in the end, actually. Ha! Ah, the mass of moon has been lost. Things should be alright, though. As long as mass and moon are lucid, they won't allow inferior hearts to wield it. I'm sure they'll turn up. The fail not. Sure, why not? A dignified sidearm. Pax Mega Power! 1.5 for MG enemies, which you've got a thing that I got for Masamuna. Masked Desire. Well, in theory, this is 44 points stronger, but... Oh, okay. Also, we need these pearl caps. Okay, hold on. Use these tools for righteous ends. Okay. Alright, I didn't afford yours. Aw, oh, but the Zonker 8000 is a great name for a gun. 
with Vorpal weight. Vorpal is in the ghost Kersnicker snack, or that it hungers for flesh, or maybe that it just severs heads on a roll of 20. What kind of Vorpal are we talking about here? Okay. Ahem. Let's get rid of this. Trusty backup sword. Ah, uh, it's a piece of junk. Oh, oh. Okay. Now, then. masked desire. Oh, have shadow damage. Very nice. I need more of those. Okay, and I'm going to give you one of these pearl caps. I'm going to give Marley one of the pearl caps. And I used a lot of resources in that last boss fight. want to save some money to try to replenish stocks. Or I could just get another pearl cap! And... Yeah, I'll give it to Luca. Why not? Yay! Hey, Luca, you learned attack. What are you working on now? Oh, life too. Hurry up and learn that one. Hmm, yes. Alright, let's save. And that'll be it for today. So much to do, so much going on, so much to explore. Hmm. Until next time, and every time, this is Hadrix signing off.